Hey guys, uh, it's uh, day 26 here. Uh, I'm uploading this at 5 in the morning because I'm a filthy degenerate with no sense of decency. Um, you may be wondering where day 25 went. Um, there was some basically copyright issues, so I am going to later upload a version of it, but um, it caused me a lot of uh, grief to try to upload it, so um, that's partially why the, uh, that's partially why it's been, my uh, uploads have been pushed a couple days back. Um, today we're going to be briefly reading the Halloween tree, an excerpt from the Halloween tree. I'm trying to get away from uh, kind of doing just one type of reading, so I'm trying to mix it up, which is also kind of hampering the uh, upload times. Hopefully I'll, I'll get things straight soon. At any rate, here is our masterful performance. The unemployed of all Europe shivered in their stone sleep and came awake, which is to say that all the old beasts and all the old tales, all the old nightmares, all the old unused demons put by and witches left in the lurch quaked at the call, reared at the whistle, trembled at the summons, and dusk devils of propulsion skinned down the roads, flitted skies, buck shot through shaken trees, forded streams, swam rivers, pierced clouds, and arrived, arrived, arrived. Which is to say that all the dead statues and idols and semi-gods and demigods of Europe lying like a dreadful snow all about, abandoned in ruins, gave up link and start, and came as salamanders on the road, or bats in the sky, or dingoes in the brush. They flew, they galloped, they skittered. Obedient to summons, the mobs, the flocks, the prides, the crush, the collection, the raving flux of monsters, beasts, vices rampant, virtues gone sour, discarded saints, misguided prides, hollow pomps oozed, slid, suckered, pelted, ran bold, and right up the sides of Notre Dame. In a flood time of nightmare, in a tidal wave of outcry and shamble, they inundated the cathedral to cross themselves on every pinion and upthrust stone. So here ran pigs, and there climbed Satan's goats, and yet another wall knew the devils which recarved themselves along the way, dropped horns and grew new ones, shaved beards to spout tendril earthworm mustaches. Sometimes a swarm of only masks and faces scuttled up the walls and took the buttress heights, carried by an army of crayfish and wobbly, crotchety lobsters. Here came the heads of gorillas full of sin and teeth. There came men's heads with sausages in their mouth. Beyond danced the mask of a fool, upheld by a spider that knew ballet. Mm-hmm. <laughs>